Of course, I, I finished my career and I had enough of, of bike racing, but if there would be one race where I would, would like to do it again, it's, it's going to be Paris Robert. If you go rewind the clock, even 10, 15 years, the difference in the kit is, is massive. Castelli have always been uh, one step ahead of the game, really. You know, stuff like the Gabba, every team has got one, or certainly a different version of it. You look at a road race skin suit, that you can race any stage in any race. Every team has them now, and that again, that, that started with Castelli. In, in Team Sky, we are really honored on, on nutrition, and uh, but especially dur during a long classic uh, like Roubaix or Flanders, uh, where you are six, six and a half hours uh, on the bike. The helmets are changed. Uh, you, Especially with the cold weather, uh, riders use more like a filled helmet, which is also more aerodynamic. So that's a big step forward. The preparation for the classics normally takes a bit more time, especially here before the first classic race, where we need to get everything ready, build the new K8 bikes for, for the riders. Then they'll go training, do some recons, and then they'll decide which bike they want to use. The main difference between the F10 and the K8 is the F10 is the normal race bike, it's a normal setup, stiff, super aerodynamic, but the K8 has a slightly different geometry, so it flexes a little bit when they go on the cobbles. At the same time, the rear stay and the fork allows a slightly bigger tyre, so in a race like Paris-Roubaix we can go to 20, 28 mm tyres and then reduce the tyre pressure a little bit when we ride the cobblestones. I've seen the equipment change quite a lot over the yeah, my brief six year period with the team really. Um, and you think how long the classics have been going on, I think there's been big changes recently. Um, obviously with teams starting to use suspension, um, we were one of the first to do that. That's obviously a massive change. Back in 2001, uh, the bike was yeah, not completely different, but it was a different bike. Uh, the material has changed, it's all carbon now, it's much lighter. But it's also much stiffer. And then also yeah, you have the, the, the carbon wheels with the high rims which were not used in, uh, back in 2001. I remember Magnus Baxter telling me when, when I was a junior and I was going to go and race the junior Pie Roubaix and he'd obviously won you know, the pro Roubaix. He said to me, you, you can't win Roubaix on good luck, but you can lose it on bad luck. And you can lose it a million and one times during the race through bad luck. So you have to be naturally talented, fit, and physically good enough to win it.